there, I'm Chef Ani. Do you notice anything different? I'm in a beautiful white kitchen. Our kitchen has now become white. And as you can see, there's a few more things we need to do in here. We're going to be changing out the countertops, countertops and also the backsplash. We are taking you along for the ride. And this is two. step number two, that we have new floor too. Oh, you can't see it. It's beautiful. Okay, it's like this gray. You're going to show them the floor? Yeah. We'll be sure to keep you updated as the process continues. A few years back when I was in culinary school in New York City, mom and I would occasionally take a mom and daughter day. And we would go out and clear my head by going for a walk or to Central Park or we would go out to eat. And one particular time, we went to this restaurant and it was a very special place. It was the ambiance was beautiful. We sat right by a window and you could look out into the into New York City. It was gorgeous. But mom and I wanted to get some inspiration for different foods, you know? Things we hadn't tried before. So we looked at the menu and we ordered a couple things. And one of the things that we ordered was a smashed potato appetizer. And these came out and mom and I could not believe how good they were. And we said, we need to go home and see if we can recreate this and put our own twist on it. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make smashed potatoes with pesto. And if any of you have been here with me for a while on this channel, you know how much I love pesto. I mean, I love pesto so much and I put it on so many dishes, but this one, I mean, this is a show-stopping potato and pesto combination. It's really quite amazing. And it's super fun because it gives you an excuse to smash potatoes. So enough talking, let's get cooking. Okay, so to get started, we are going to be using organic potatoes. And we like to use organic potatoes because we keep the peel on, so we're not going to be peeling these. And I love to use smaller potatoes for this because it's cute with the little pesto on it. It's gonna look amazing. So I'm going to pick out a few of these potatoes and wash them really well. Okay, so I've washed my potatoes and now we're just going to put it in a pot and we're going to barely cover with water, add a little salt, and then bring to a boil. So while our potatoes are boiling, we are going to make our pesto. And this is so easy to make. You basically combine just a few of my favorite ingredients, and then you have the best pesto ever. So I'm adding in some garlic, and I just chop it up just a little bit as it goes in to um, make it easier for the food processor. We have some pine nuts, some nutritional yeast flakes, some crushed red pepper, a little salt, and a little freshly squeezed lemon juice. Now we pulse this into a paste. So as you can see here, we have made a paste of all these ingredients. And now while the food processor is running, we are going to add in some olive oil. There we go. So our potatoes are done boiling. We just cooled them slightly and then put them out on a baking sheet tray. Okay, so now we're on to the fun part. This is really fun. You can get the kids involved. They will love doing this. So now we're just going to brush each one with a little bit of olive oil and sprinkle with some salt. If you have a little bit of a coarser salt, this works well for this. Now all we have left to do is to pop this in the oven to crisp up a little bit. Okay, so our potatoes have come out of the oven and I'm excited to try them. I'm so excited to try these. Take a little of this beautiful pesto. So you can top it off with some pine nuts for some texture or some tomatoes for some red color. Or you can sprinkle a little bit of crushed red pepper on top. Mm -hmm. mm. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to join me in this adventure to eat healthier, one recipe at a time. And I look forward to seeing you next Wednesday with another video. We'll be sure to keep you updated as the process continues. Anyway, today in honor... You want to see my sparkly yeah. shoes? Aren't those spectacular? Kaya surprised me with these beautiful sparkly shoes. Hmm? I love them so much.